Stay cool. Here he comes. This is a Thor News presentation. Thor News presents. Hello, I am your Indiana Jones of Lens Artifacts. I am your premier solar scientist. All right, totally great news. Today, we're talking about solar equines. Uh, I guess what I'm saying is there's a horse in the sun, and it kind of ends up looking like the horse head nebula that is in Orion. If you notice here, we have a seven. And that seven will grow to be our horse. Or it's a vector sign. Or it's a V. Or it's whatever you want to call it. Part of the magic of Thor News. Is the fact that. I encourage you to believe whatever you want. I want you to think about it. Do your due diligence. And then come to the conclusion. That you believe. I may be one of the last bastions on earth. Is not telling you what to think. You see him? Here you go, Horsehead Nebula. And see all these little black dots? I don't ever remember seeing them before. See how like there's no black dots, little bitty black dots over here? But but they sure come. Yes, they do. So we got seven. That a three, or maybe it's a snake. And then the black dots appear. Man, they are moving and shaking and swimming and going crazy. And if you remember the Horsehead Nebula, it's one of the most striking images from the Hubble. It's gorgeous. It looks cool, and it's got that Godfather gangster appeal to it. Like, if you don't shut up, we're going to Godfather gangster you. So, one of the main themes here at Thor News has been, wow, the sun has been freaking out, acting strange, acting different. And the funny thing is, is that there are no solar experts and that at best we know maybe one or two percent of solar physics and the how, how what why when and where and so the combination of the horsehead nebula and the moving little black dot man that makes it totally fascinating with everything that's been going on last month Forgive me. If I don't share your unfascination, so you got a horse and a seven. Horsey seven? Seven horse. I guess that means rush down to your local racetrack, take all your money. And bet it on the seventh horse. Reminds me of a joke. Guy yeah, said, So I had a dream. And in the dream, I just saw a big number six. And so I took the six bus down to the racetrack. And I bet all my money on the sixth horse. And well, he came in sixth. But I'm bumped. I'd say it was funny. Why are those dots moving like that? And then at the end, a lot of them show up. It's like somebody's pouring salt and pepper on the sun. Was that big red giant looking thing maybe a giant giant and gonna eat our sun? That was a joke. Don't freak out. Jeez, man. I thought. I requested people without senses of humor not watching my videos. All right, so that's pretty neat. 
that's pretty interesting. And more evidence that the sun is acting strange. But not as strange as people, man. People are strange when they are strangers. On the internet, faces look ugly and they come out in the crowd. Women are wicked and I am unwanted. I'll see you soon from Thor News. Hey, when you're strange, no one remembers your name. When you're strange.